you didn't show up today with HIV, AIDS, any of them deadly sexual transmitted diseases that'll make you die in two, three weeks, put a cell phone like in the air. Lady, if your pussy smell like water, put a cell phone like in the air. Fellas, lights up. Fellas, if you ain't sucking nigga dick in the parking lot, put your cell phone like Let's be real about this shit. Yeah, keep it fucking real. So to get it started, you guys saw what the baby said at Rolling Loud. He offended the LGBTQ community and pissed off the Twitter warriors. In my opinion, this whole situation is dumb and none of this backlash should have been this bad. He got cancelled from a lot of shows and I get it, it's for marketing and things like that, but man, the baby did not deserve this. The internet is super soft nowadays and it amazes me how there's these people on the internet thinking they're superheroes of the fucking world. In reality, it's all dumb trying to cancel people unless it's 100% necessary. Like, for example, with the EDP 445 situation, he needed his platform fucking taken down because he was a danger to the public and was weird to say the least. I'm not saying that baby made smart statements that night at Rolling Loud at all, but he did not deserve the amount of shit he got. But at the end of the day, he's going to come out of this bigger than ever. I'm not with cancel culture, it's pointless, and you're worse than the person who did the act to get quote unquote cancelled. The baby after apologized soon, and we're gonna actually react to that real quick and see what the baby said in his apology. I'm gonna address this weak ass internet shit one time, and I'm gonna get back to giving my love to my fans. See what I'm saying? Because what me and my fans do at the live show. It don't concern you niggas on the internet or you bitter bitches on the internet. It's not y'all business. You know what I'm saying? Like what I do at a live show is for the audience at the live show. It'll never translate correctly to somebody looking at a little five, six second clip from their goddamn crib on their phone. The baby is low key right. Like they weren't there at the Rolling Loud show. They don't understand the context. They just see the clip and they attack him for the clip. It's kind of stupid. It just don't work like that. Like, you know, because regardless of what you motherfuckers talking about or how the internet and twisted up my motherfucking word, me and all my fans at the show, the gay ones and the straight ones, we turned the fuck up. I'm talking about my boy that was at the front of the stage, left over there by where I jumped at. Ask him. He got clips all on his shit. The whole night was recording. We were turned the whole night. My boy had the crop top on. Front row, yeah, out there in that, in that jungle, in that water. Yeah, he out there. He's standing on the rail, got them cutting up. He words. I saw him. I'm, I'm rapping them bitches with him. Yeah, the hell y'all talking about? Y'all niggas, shut the fuck up. You niggas, you niggas that wasn't, that ain't at the show. The show is for the niggas who paid the money and, and took the time out of their life to come enjoy the show. Not you motherfuckers watching it. On the internet at the crib. No, nigga, just get your tickets and come fuck with the live show killer. Gay or straight. Don't let these motherfuckers. The motherfuckers are hell. I, I say, if you don't got AIDS, put a cell phone light up. I say, if you ain't suck dick in the parking lot, put your cell phone lights up. So I could drop my next song. I wasn't going on no rant. That's called a call to action. That's what that's called, because I'm a live performer. I'm the best. What you said was genuinely questionable, the baby, but you didn't deserve the backlash at all. But what you said, bro, was kind of weird. You didn't have to say that. Like there was no need for it at all. Live perform on the live show, killer. You interact with your fans. You get what I'm saying? Look, all the lights went up, gay straight. You wanna know why? Cause even my gay fans don't got fucking AIDS. Stupid ass niggas. They don't got AIDS. My gay fans, they take care of themselves. They ain't going bad. They ain't, they ain't no nasty gay niggas. You know what I'm saying? They ain't no junkies. You know what I'm saying? On the street. Man, yeah, you talking about, nigga? Then I said, if you ain't suck dick in the rolling loud parking lot, put your cell phone light up. You know what my gay fans did? Put that motherfucking light up, nigga. Do I think the baby deserved this backlash? No. Do I think the baby deserved to be canceled from all those shows? No. But people are gonna follow the trend, people are gonna follow the leader, and people are gonna follow what everyone else is doing at the end of the day. 
Anyways, peace out, you guys. I love you.